Hello everyone, my name is Yulia and welcome to my island! And welcome back if you are one of my 100 subscribers! Yay! Let's celebrate it! It's such a great achievement! Thank you so much to anyone who subscribed to my channel! Me and my villagers decided to throw a little block party just to commemorate this event! So here you go! And today, um, also to kind of celebrate it, and uh, because I have been decorating around my island a little bit and building it up, but I am trying to collect more items to just continue all of my builds and just to make my vision come true, um, I decided to do a little tours of inspirations for this island. So I chose three islands to tour today. Two of them are from the creators on YouTube. Uh, one is Liz the Last. Uh, she's wonderful. I'll link all of her information down below. And so is the dream address to her island that I'm going to be touring. She has a Normcore island, so we will see it. Another one is my favorite Angry Coconut. I really love his channel and his island is a huge inspiration for this one. So we will be touring um, El Nu. And uh, the third island that I chose is going to be by a creator that she's not on YouTube. Her name is Amanda. She's on Instagram and I will also link her information below about her island. So without further ado, let's just go. Yay! So we're now finally in tiny town TM. This is the island of Liz the Last. She designed this Norcore island. And I really think about this island a lot now that I build up my own. She also left little presents so we can have a cute outfit. Let's pick them all up and see how she decided to dress us for this tour. Oh, perfect. Look how cute. <laughs> I know she also has little prezies over here. Let's just pick Franklin. If she has a balloon. Oh, a balloon. That's great. Let's hold the balloon as we tour. So as you see, you uh, right next to the rest and services, there is this cute orchard that is so sweet. And here's the entrance and the airport. Oh, the waterfalls by the entrance, just so awesome. I like it. I like it so much. It's such a cool place for a bridge too. I really like this bridge. I think it's going to be the next one I place on my island as well. So let's just look at the map first before we're getting too far away. So you can see Dream Address if you want to visit the town yourself. And you can see Lizzie, she lives right over there in the corner of the island. She has BB, Billy, Hornsby, Sprinkle, B, Pecan, Raymond, Meringue, Rolled, and Octavian. Look at this map, it's so cute. What is happening by the museum? <laughs> Whoa, so adorable. Let's go, let's go see. Let's go this way first. Okay, by the orchard. And here's some sort of a market area. Very cute. There's plants of all kinds, music and books. Oh, how cute is this? I have never seen this item before. I'm guessing maybe it's the one that you get during the blossom, uh, cherry blossom season. I haven't gotten too many of those items myself yet. Oh, beach is so adorable. Hi, Raymond. Oh, and Sprinkle is here. She is on my island, as you know. Look at all the cakes! Oh my goodness, this cake looks so delicious! Oh, such a cute cafe! Very nice! Oh, look at the cemetery of villagers! <laughs> Maybe it was a previous residence. I have not seen her actually play this island too much. I found this island when her video of the tour was posted, so I really, really liked it. 
And so I don't know, there's probably some previous villagers that move, <laughs> moved out or were mysteriously disappeared. Oh, look at this little flower beds. This is adorable. Oh, and here too. So nice. Oh, concert area. Beautiful. Oh, this is such a great idea. I might do that on my island too. This is this looks so beautiful. The purple windflower. I've never bred that one before myself. I'm really hoping to do it um, this time. Because I really like the windflowers, how they look. I think they're going to be perfect for my island. Oh, a little playground. Very cute. Look at that. Oh, adorable. Let's go further. Oh, that's the museum area. Okay, let's go to this side first because I see a little Zen garden over here. Little beach decorations. Very cute. This is very nice. Very well done. I was thinking of uh, doing a Zen garden on my island. I've never done one before. So that's a really good example. Oh, she makes you jump through the hoops over here just to get to museum. That's great. <laughs> I love it. I love when creators do that so they make you work to get somewhere. <laughs> this is so nice. I will take a picture when I jump all the way back <laughs> or maybe like in the middle, like here. Let's take a photo. <laughs> this is such a great idea. <laughs> Look at and look how gorgeous it looks. Oh wow. Okay, let's go. Let's go this way now. I hope I'm doing doing it correctly. I don't really tour other people's islands ever. Uh, especially on camera. Sometimes I visit them for inspiration. That is a beautiful rock garden. Very nice. Oh look, an archaeology dig. That is so cool creative I love it Ooh. oh and another dig look at that we have a ladder by the way we can go down and explore in here this is so creative I absolutely love that what a great idea Wow <laughs> Definitely taking a picture. I don't know if I could build something like this on my island. This is just very creative, very nice. Let's go up. Oh. Where's my balloon? Here it is. <laughs> oh, star fragments. I haven't had um, a star fall on my island yet, actually. I don't really play at night that much. I mean, I do play at night in real life, but I always rewind time to be a day in time, just so the shops are open and everything. I think we just have to go back from here. Let me just check the map real quick. Okay, where are we? Okay, we're over there. Yeah, I think we just have to go back and go all the way down to the residential neighborhoods to, to see them. I can't wait. I really love when uh, the neighborhoods are done so that all the villagers live together. It's really nice. Even though that's not something that I'm doing right now on my island, I might do that in the future. Because I know that I will probably be remodeling my island more when I get more items. Right now I'm putting in some builds already. I have really limited amount of number of items yet. Okay, this is Phoebe's house, yeah. Because if you didn't know, Phoebe's house on the inside looks just crazy. It looks crazy. It looks like lava everywhere. <laughs> but I know that Liz mentioned that because it was one of her first villagers, she did not have her original house and she was just in a simple house, you know, like for the starters. So she decided to incorporate it in the design of her yard. These flower beds are so pretty. I love it. Wow. And look at this diner. Oh my goodness, adorable. Let's let's take a picture here too. <laughs> I'm going to be taking pictures everywhere. 
Oh, there you go. There's Liz. Right there. <laughs> and VB <Phoebe> too. <laughs> this is so pretty. This is incredible. All the colors are just so pleasing. I love it. Oh, and this is a drive-in movie theater. That's great. <laughs> What is, what is this item? I have never seen it before in the game. That one right there. Oh, oh, can I access it? No, I can't really play with it, but that's okay. Let's go further. I like the beaches. They're so nice. Hi, Liz. <laughs> nice. This is such a fun island. It just... it is just fun. It just gives you the mood of just being so light and adorable. Let's see all of the neighborhoods now. Whose house is this? The house looks so pretty. Can I... can I read it or am I gonna just... It's Billy's house, okay. He has a little basketball court... activity court, I would say. Very cute. Oh, this looks so pretty. Oh, I think this is Hornsby's house, right? It's so blue. Yeah. Oh, and his area just looks adorable. So sweet. I love it. Look how cute. Oh. This is Bee's house with a little bee farm. Cute. <laughs> Wow, this is absolutely beautiful island. Oh, is it a spring? This is Sprinkles house? Rolled. Of course, he's another penguin. <laughs> it's so cool. They have such frozen exteriors. And this is Sprinkle, yeah. Oh, look how pretty. Can Should we go here? I think there might have been a different entrance to that area, so I will just continue down the road and then we'll see. Oh, and a third level also neighbors are here. <laughs> Raymond viewing <laughs> selfie five. <laughs> that is so funny. <laughs> Poor Raymond. <laughs> that is hilarious. Oh my goodness. Oh, very spacey. Who's who lives here? I can't see because of the rock. Whose house is this? Octavian, of course. This is amazing. This is so... such a unique place and such a cool way to implement all of the space items because I never knew how to put them in my game. <laughs> oh, this is so sweet. It's Meringue, of course. That's why it's so sweet. Look how many desserts she has. This is cute. I had Meringue on one of my previous islands. She's a very adorable villager. I really like her. Oh. <laughs> her yard is great. Okay, let's go there. And this one, who is this? Oh, I also cannot see. Let's check here. Oh, pecan, of course. She has very classy yard. Very beautiful. Wow. Ooh, look at this. Such a beautiful way to incorporate all those Celeste furniture. What a beautiful area. I absolutely love it. This is great. Oh my goodness. I get so much inspiration from this island. This is great. Wow. Let's go. Can we go from here to there? I don't know how to get there. Let me in. I don't, I don't know. Should I just climb down? I don't think I can. Okay, let's go around. Maybe somewhere around here. Yeah, okay, bye. Look at this, it's so cute. Well, this is where the campsite area is. This is just 
incredibly stunning campsite area. So beautiful. Look at that. With all the hybrids of the flowers, everything just looks so great. This is awesome. <laughs> oh, look, a little bridge. Oh, you can see, definitely see shooting stars over here. Very nice. Oh, and you can come down here to the secret beach. Oh, pirate treasure. Perfect. <laughs> okay, let's go further. <gasps> Look at that flower field. Oh my goodness. This is incredible. But first, let's go just all the way down to see how everything is from here. Because we missed this bridge. Did I miss it? Okay, this is where... It goes from the neighborhoods here. Let's just see the beach. Oh, nice. There's a little bit more decorated beach with an arcade. Cute. Oh, Nook's Cranny is right here. Very nice. I really like how it's decorated. And some boxes and barrels, of course vending machines and the little gas station. <laughs> I like how she used the beds for the cars. It's very adorable. What is in here? Oh, of course, Able Sisters. Little tea drinking area. Adorable. And of course, some sewing. Oh, you can sit on a little mushroom and work on your project. That is cute. I love how the papers are just here. I guess it's like taxes for their store. <laughs> it's just on the ground. Okay, okay, let's see the flower field. This is incredible. Oh my god. Look at this. Oh my god. <laughs> oh wow. This is so beautiful. This is incredible. Oh, can you imagine? I don't know how long it would take me to do a field like this on my island, but now I just want to do it. It, it looks stunning. It looks incredible. Can I just run through flowers? You can damage them on the dream island. <gasps> wow, this is gorgeous. <laughs> this is incredible. I have never seen a field like this on a tour before. Wow. Absolutely beautiful. Let's run. I think that's where Alyssa's house is. She has a little plant area. Little rubber ducky swimming in the pool. And this is her house. Oh, beautiful. Oh, and a shell furniture rock. <laughs> a classic. Nice. I think we did see everything. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi, guys. This is absolutely gorgeous. I'm completely in love with this field of flowers. This is so beautiful. Oh, you think I could do it on my island? That would be amazing if I could. That would be absolutely amazing if I could. <laughs> It would be my dream, definitely. Oh, wow. Let's take a, a last glimpses on this island and we'll move on to the next one. Oh, gorgeous. This is a gorgeous island. So beautiful. Wow. Thank you so much to Liz and her beautiful island and that she posted a dream code. This is completely amazing and beautiful. Let's go to the next island now. Okay, so we're on our second island. This is an island by Angry Coconut. And here is his map. It's called El New. There is a dream address um, below if you want to visit it yourself. So this lives here. He has Teddy, Peck, Cherry, Pom Pom, Coco, Carmen, Dobby, Tom, Goldie, and Hugh. Look at this map, it's so elaborate. I love it. Let's go explore. I know that this island... Ooh! 
There's some gifts. What is this? Oh, cute. And let's take a letter just in case. Okay, so let's see. Here's the island entrance. Oh, this island is just magically decorated. It's so adorable. I have seen some of the builds that he did here while he was recording it and uh, it's absolutely beautiful. Let's just go this way first. It's very easy to get lost on this island, I feel like, just because it is decorated just so amazingly. Like it has so many little areas everywhere and you just want to get lost in this city. Look, Able Sisters right here. Look at this bridge view, so nice. Okay, let's go. Let's go to the right side first. Um, this is Dobby's house. Oh, what a nice little area. There's so many little things around. It's beautiful. Let's go through this bridge first and see what's here. Okay. Oh, nice observation area. Oh, look at Goldie. This is so well done because the river doesn't leave that much space on the ground to decorate, but he just did it perfectly, I think. Okay, let's go further here. Just in between the trees, you can exit to the beach. Oh, so pretty. Look at this tanuki. <laughs> A little football field here. Another train track. This is pretty. Wow. So many great areas. Another pumpkin patch and a little doggy. Look at this little area. It's it's so well done. You just want to spend your time in the little nooks and crannies of this island. Oh. Little playground. So colorful and beautiful. Okay, where should we go? I don't want to get lost. <laughs> Let's run down this train track and see what's there. Here's a little area. I don't think it leads to anywhere. Oh, look at this little foresty overgrown area. And it leads you to Secret Beach. <gasps> look at the painting, it's so beautiful. <laughs> nice. Okay, let's go back so we don't get lost. I already got lost. Here? Yeah, let's go here. Let's go back through this blue bridge and we'll go try to find other villagers' houses around. Wow, this is so well done. I love all, all the use of fences and all the bushes. Just beautiful. Dobby has a pumpkin patch. He's a pumpkin farmer. Like, look at this little area. It, has, it just adds so much character. Absolutely beautiful. More snack and drinks machines. Okay, we're by rest and services, so let's go up here. See what's there. Oh? Who lives here? Cherry. Nice. And this one is Pom Pom's house? Yeah, Pom Pom's house. Like, look how well it fits, just fits this neighborhood. It's not overwhelming, even though they don't have big yards or anything. It's just being incorporated so well. He just has such a great eye for decorating such islands. Oh, more villagers here. <gasps> look how pretty. Oh my goodness. I just want to take all the pictures everywhere. Is 
This is absolutely beautiful. <laughs> it's, it's all I have to say. It's, I feel like that's all I'm saying, but it is all I have to say. It's so pretty. Let's go this way. Okay. Oh, this is how we got up. Perfect. So let's just run straight here. Okay, another area here. Oh, that's where we were on the train track and the path to Secret Beach. Yeah. Oh, perfect. I would never even come up to, with terraforming like this. This is beautiful. Oh, is this is this where museum is hiding? Oh yeah, look. How well is this done? This is great. Wow. Gorgeous. And he has flowers implemented so well here and there. More snacks, some fish, <laughs> an ant. This is beautiful. Even here, like behind the museum, look at this small area. It looks so cute. Okay, let's not get lost. And should we go here? Yeah. Um... Oh, look at this little, like, city lake. I'm not even sure if you... I mean, technically it is a lake in Animal Crossing terms. But you know, it just adds such a city feel. Because sometimes you see in the cities there are some bodies of water. They're a little bit unexplainable, but they are there. Oh. Look how overgrown and like just how pretty this is. I love it. Oh, look at the cookies over there. So pretty. The decorations here are absolutely amazing. Okay, this is where a museum is. Let's go further. <laughs> I'm getting lost. Okay. Look at this little cute street. Wait, there is a campsite right here. Oh, so pretty, so well done. Look at that. If you want some urban camping. Just very well done. Oh, this is Coco's house. She has a big plot around her house. So pretty too. Oh, look at the lake. Should we go down? I have a ladder. <gasps> and all the flowers here. Adorable. And you can fish here. Oh. It just seems so peaceful on this part of the island. You can go fish. Very nice. Oh yeah, there's a letter sign right here. <laughs> Makes sense. Let's go further down. Oh. Oh, this is so interesting how he did this. Look at this, like just a bamboo and then you chop it down and you have those thingies. Never thought about it myself. Oh, so well done. It's so beautiful. And so colorful too. It's interesting because it seems like this overgrown type of um, a little bit rusted elements everywhere aesthetic, but yet it is so colorful at the same time. Look at the peninsula, so nice. Oh. Oh, it's high. Hope you're doing well. Yay! <laughs> I'm a big fan of his channel, so it kind of feel I feel starstruck that I met him on the island. <laughs> oh, another villager's house. Is that Tom? Tom's house, I think. Okay, and I think we I think we covered it, right? What about this little cliff? I haven't seen it. Can you get to it or? Maybe you can't really get to it, but let's try from the different angle. So this is the entrance where we started. 
There's some trains here. I don't think we can get through there. No, it doesn't seem that I can get there. Oh, but there's another house. Oh, there you go. <laughs> oh, pretty. Look at that. And so close to resident services and yet it feels so natural to be here. Isn't that Teddy's house? Yeah. And the nook's cranny. Oh my goodness, like this island, you just want to get lost in it. And it's so easy to. Look, nook's cranny with the little flower uh, patch here. Ah, oh, so beautiful. Okay, thank you for the hospitality, Vis. The silence was absolutely gorgeous. I absolutely loved it. This was so beautiful. Let's visit the third island, the final one for today. And it's going to be a colorful Kitcore Island. So let's see. So as I was trying to take you on the colorful Kitcore Island done by Amanda, for some reason her uh, dream address did not work. It said that the island does not exist. And I'm thinking maybe she just flattened it and redid the island or something like that. So I had to improvise and I found a different colorful Kitcore Island to tour. This one is called Milky Way. I will also link the information about it below. Uh, but this one is an absolute surprise to me. I have no idea what to expect. It is another creator on Instagram. I don't believe they have a YouTube channel. But I will investigate and leave all the information below. But for now, let's just enjoy this surprise uh, tour, okay? So, let's see the map first. Ooh, everything is covered in paths. Perfect. Joanna is right here, the creator. And she has Shino, Pietro, Hamlet, Peanut, Dom, Stitches, Molly, Darwin, Megan and Freckles. Oh, such all oh, such a cute villagers everywhere. This is great. I can't wait to explore it. So we are in resident services. This is already looking very, very interesting. Look at this construction site right behind it. This is so cool. Oh my god, I love it. Let's go try to find our way to the airport. Ooh, so pretty. Oh my goodness, this is so pretty. Oh, I can't wait to explore it already. I think we stumbled on just the perfect island for the inspiration for me. Oh, let's just go this way. I want to find an airport. Oh, this island is pretty cluttered, so you will see some loading, as I understand. This is the airport. It's yellow and bright. Perfect. This road is really pretty. The custom designs here. Okay, let's go to the right first. That's when we, uh, since that's where we came from, and just explore from there. Oh, a very convenient area with your storage and your ATM right here. Everything so colorful. Wow. <laughs> Look at this ice cream shop. It's Baskin Robbins. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, it looks so adorable. Oh, I just love the feel of this island. It's colorful and kind of... Uh, there's like trash here and there. I love it. So many custom designs. Perfect. Wow. The beach is super colorful too. Oh, they have blathers still in the tent. Oh, interesting. I don't see that too often. He has a lot of creatures here. I really like to fill up my museum, so I never leave my... Um, I never leave blathers in a tent. But I can definitely see how, if you want it for design purposes, how it is very convenient to do it. Oh, let's let everything load. Let's go. Oh, wow. It's so colorful. Oh, look at this beach. Also so colorful with yachts and stuff. Very pretty. Let's go up in here. And there's a cherry blossom season. So perfect. Oh, hi. Here's the creator. Oh, sorry. 
welcome. Thank you. She's so adorable. Oh, I really like this. Her house is so cute too. <laughs> I want this item soon on my island. I don't have it yet. I want it for decoration so much. Who lives here? Megan. Nice. All the yards are so colorful. Look at this neighborhood. Just perfect. This is again from Resident Services, right? No? Oh. This island seems so big to me. This is so unfamiliar. Look at this duck pond. Oh. So pretty. Let's take a picture here. Oh. This island is lagging a little bit because of how many items are here, but that's very understandable, you know? Oh, so pretty. Look at that. The custom designs are adorable too. A little clothes shop. And of course, the Sable sisters are here. Oh, the little froggy chair. Dom, hi! Oh my god, I love Dom. Thank you. <laughs> Dom is adorable. Let's see where I am so I don't get lost. Okay. So we have seen some of the villagers' houses, but I missed the second row of the villagers. So let's go there. Oh, this just looks so great. So many items, a little car park with a gas station. Perfect. And look. Timmy and Tommy are here. Oh, isn't that adorable? Look at this birthday area. This is so cute. Wow, I feel underdressed, definitely. For such a bright island. Look how pretty this is. Oh, I blink again. <laughs> Am I getting lost again or will I see another other villagers' houses? This is a nice little area too. Oh, there you go! Oh, pretty! All of their yards also look so great. Look, this is the flower arranging station for freckles. The freckles is the cutest ever. A little carrot patch here. Nice. Absolutely beautiful and colorful. Such a great island. Okay, let's go back to the birthday area and we'll continue from there. Or can I go here? It's a little... Oh! <gasps> Look at this th movie theater area. Isn't that beautiful? There is a popcorn if you want it. So pretty. Okay. Down there, there is a campsite. So I want to go see how I can get there. How can I get there? It's probably from here, right? Oh, oh my goodness, look at that! There's a Godzilla versus robot fighting. The city is little town is burning. This is perfect, wow. How did they come up with this idea? This is so creative. So beautiful. Wow. Oh, look at this land bridge here. Leading you to campsite. Very nice and colorful. Oh. Let's go there because like something on the left just looks amazing. I want to see it. Another bridge. Look at that. I just want to take all the pictures. And this was an island that I just just found because I wanted a colorful Kid Core island. I just found it and it was so perfect. <laughs> I don't think I will be doing my island as colorful. I just want to implement some of the brightness into my island. But this is such a great example of amazingly colorful island. Oh. <laughs> What is the present, I wonder? Should we check? Oh, it's a wasp nest. What? <laughs> oh, 
Oh, is this for pictures? Or is this you enter somewhere? I feel like, you know, it's like when you arrive to a party and you can do a little picture photo sesh. Yay! <laughs> this is so much fun. Such a fun island. Well, look at this. Oh my god. Oh, I guess it's like entrance into different attractions, probably. A little hot dog stand. Yes, please. Look, they have sandwiches here. <laughs> Adorable. Okay, let's go here. Circus, yeah. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, who is this villager? Pietro, of course. Which Kid Core Island is complete without Pietro and Stitches, right? I don't know if we can go... Yeah. Let's go here. Oh, oh, oh. Let's try to avoid the lag, maybe. Look at this little dog bark. Oh my god. How adorable is this? Oh. I can't. This is amazing. <laughs> such a great idea too okay are we back oh no that's not Baskin Robbins that's another okay so we're able sisters now we've been there let's just go this way oh a little bit of lagging I'm trying to avoid it a little hi let's play football oh what is happening here is this school? Oh, <laughs> this is so perfect. Little play area. Wow. And is this a cafeteria? Oh, perfect. This is such a great build. Let's go down here. basketball court hi oh look at that it's just like you're in a small city I love the cherry blossom season it just looks so great a school bus and look at this playground it's so colorful Oh, a little bus stop. Oh my god, this is so cute. And I think I'm back at the entrance. Yeah, let's go find our way back to rest and services. This is incredible. I took so many pictures on all of the islands. I'm ready. I'm ready to do my island now. <laughs> I got so inspired. All of these creators are great. I will leave all of the descriptions below as well. But let's go back to my island now. And here we are. I'm back on Sorrel. As you can see, it is winter and very chilly and snowy. So my villagers are all wearing warm clothes. Very cute. Um, thank you so much for joining me on these tours of inspiration and to see the islands that I chose as my inspirations for mine. Um, thank you so much for 100 subscribers again. This is incredible. I feel very blessed that all of you decided to join and watch my adventures on Sorrel and my decorating struggles here. Thank you so much. If you like this video, please press like, subscribe to my channel to join us and uh, Thank you so much again for watching. I will see you in my next video, guys. Bye.